So how are we doing guys? Welcome, it's Kraken here and we are at the beginning of day number 15 and the hall base held up really well. We got these being upgraded now to reinforce concrete, I believe. Um so yeah, we're doing we're doing really well. So let's um let's quickly have a quick look at what we're doing today. We've got some bones from the dogs that we killed. Get that into there. Um we're gonna take some stuff ourselves to the traders, actually. Need to put a few of these um tools away. Uh no, that's not what I wanted to put in there. I wanted to put leather in there. Uh, we've got our lucky go goggles that we keep forgetting to put on. Uh let's put some of our ammo and our guns away. We'll put that away. That, 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 and that away. We don't need uh yeah, we do mm, 72 should be fine. Uh any other weapons we're putting away? No, we'll keep all of those on us. We've got over here medical supplies. We don't need all of this on us. We will scrap those. That can hold that and that in. Bring our brass down to here. Wherever you've disappeared to. Um, put that block in there. Coffee and whatnot into here. Coffee, water. How is our food and our health looking? Not looking too bad. Okay, we'll wait till we um, find some out and about. Um, I have just made some more leather by scrapping that armor. Silly, silly thing for me to do. We need to start sorting this out. There we go. Um, some forged steel. Bring that down to here. Those jukes on our bike. Feathers. And last but not least, the hammer. Right, there we go. Sorry to do that on camera, but um, sometimes people do like just to have a have a little look at how we're doing everything. Like I say, hall base held up absolutely fine. Um, I haven't played this this world in a week because I've been. As I say, I thought I had a better bike than that. Um, haven't played it in a week because I've been trying to get these videos out daily for you guys. It meant because I'm working so much, I had to do a whole week's worth of recording just over last weekend. So I've been edit editing it up during the week as I go along and then and then been releasing the videos each day for you. Now, let's go over here and let's do this quest over here. Dishonorable Discharge. Now, I believe this one is all the army zombies and they can actually be quite tough. Um, let's put our junk turret down, Mr. T. How are we looking game stage now? 49, not too bad, not too bad at all. Uh, let's have a quick look at the points. We've got two points available uh, from the Horde Knight. Um, Sexy Saurus is doing really well. I really want to put another one into minus 69er. Um, Pummel Pete. I think we're fine for all of this. Intellect. I don't think... We really need to go any higher into intellect. To be honest, if we get a 4x4, we'll buy one like we did the motorcycle. Um, advanced engineering. We do need to go into electrician, which is level 6. We're at level 5, so at some point we will look at that. Right, let's give this a go. There's my baseball bat. Here we go. We've got the army zombies. Let's turn that light off. I find it can be very glary during the day. On Edgar on his way in. There we go. There we go, Edgar. This was not your party. And we got another egg. 
There you go. Trying to gate crash our party. Right, so that should now be done. Dishonorable discharge. So we'll get that next time we go to a zomb uh, go to a trader. Right now we had a load of problems with these, didn't we? Um, old Tudor house, church level one, old business strip. Right, I don't think we've done any of these free. Obviously, we kept getting the um, Home Depot and a few of the others coming back up. We'd already done. So, which direction is this one in? Let's go and do the business strip. So here we go, guys. Just coming up on the business strip now. Um, we've had some more news released about Alpha 19. Lots of big and exciting things coming up. But one thing that they have said they're not going to do now until Alpha 20 is the new vehicle. So we're all looking forward to there being a brand new vehicle in the game. Um... And we are a little bit cold, but um, we've actually got, I think, the best stuff on for us at the moment. Yeah, we've got the best stuff we we can for, for the cold. We're going to repair these. Um, just a note, any armour, if they go down to zero health, will not actually give you any of the, um, the armour rating. So, something does look like it's going to go down low. Then it's worth doing that. So we're here. This is a clear. So we're going to have to go through the whole thing. Um, and basically kill everybody. So as always do our little bits in the front. So yeah we're not going to get the new vehicle. Or um, Alpha 19. Which is a shame. But um, you know hey ho it's the way it is. Um, there'll, be a, there'll be a very good reason for that. Some pimps never like to put out anything if it's not actually complete. Um, but we have been... Make sure you join us on the Discord if you haven't already, because that's where we've been putting all the renders, all the pictures of all the new stuff that is going to be coming up in Alpha 19. Um, also, when we're going to be live streaming as well, because we're going to be able to start doing that again this Sunday. So I'm actually recording this video the day it's going to be going out. Bloody lumberjacks. So this is actually Good Friday. This will be going up in a couple of hours' time. So today I've actually managed to, because I've got today off. I am having to work Saturday tomorrow, though. I have had today off, so I've been doing a bit of um, a bit of experimenting today. We've got the mod launcher all installed now. And the live stream that we're going to be doing this Sunday is going to be on Darkness Falls. So I did a quick stream earlier today on Twitch. Uh, they've already broken that out. Right, let's get into here. So we are going to be doing a live stream on Sunday, myself and Supercule, on Darkness Falls. So I did a test stream today on Twitch. I did a couple of hours. It seems to... Oh, hello. Seems to be... Um, Seems to be really good. Um, there's a lot of different things and different elements that we've got to think about playing playing that game. Um, but yeah, we're going to do a live stream on that this Sunday. So watch out for that. Oh, hello. What scope have we got here? Times four. Now that can actually go onto here, I believe. So we can take our times two off, put our four onto there. And I don't think that has a spare slot, does it? No. Okay, so when we get a better pistol, we'll put the times two onto there. Right. Because we tried to play with that, we've got to reload it. Let's carry on. Another lumberjack. Yeah, they are an absolute pain. Absolute pain. Down in two. Right. Yeah, so Darkness Falls looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. So we're going to get the live series, live stream, started on Sunday with that. And um, let me know down below what you guys think. You know, do you want to see a modded series go alongside... 
the how to series um i'm always going to keep the vanilla game series going no no plans on stopping that at all but we can always put something alongside it because i've never played modded before i never even had the um the mod launcher i knew about it i knew of it um have done for years but i've never actually used it before until today today was the first ever time so there we go and downstairs we go oh we'll get rid of you while we're here as we have to clear everybody out I was going to start beating out of there. Suitcase. Garbage. Couple of jukes. Right. Now listen here, Noisy. The one good thing about um, Darkness Falls is they actually bring up a health bar of each zombie, so you actually know how many... Well, that's nice. How many hit points they've actually got left. So that's um, that's really cool. I have seen people do that on vanilla. There is a mod you can put on to vanilla, um, but it didn't work. It didn't work quite as well. Any more ammunition in here for us? Search the sink. Oh, we got a schematic there. Two. Right. Okay. So we can now make cornbread. Okay. And aloe vera seeds. Scrap that, scrap that, scrap that. Right, let's carry on. Up the ladder we go. Here we go. Oh. Come on, guys. I can't remember. Have we actually seen our first feral zombie yet? I know we spoke about it. An episode, episode or two ago. We seen our first runner yet? Hey Nancy, do you need a hand? Ladies, 
know you like to fight over me, but, um, you know, we ain't got time for any of that shen shenanigans today. Right. Ooh. Ooh, that looked like a game changer. Shotgun turret schematic. Oh, I'm going to have to have a drink of my tea. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. So now all those pesky little vultures that we're getting on horde nights can now be all sorted out. Oh, can't pick up the chair because it needs repairing. Pick up that one, though. And we'll take our bolt back. Thank you very much. Anything else in here? So, yeah, we can now set that up above the base and that will sort out those pesky little vultures. So, scrap that. Iron arrows, scrap that, scrap that. I do normally keep the cans because we need them for making oil. But we're going to end up a little bit too encumbered today if we do that. Ooh, ran into you a little bit because I wanted to stay away from you. There we go, we got ourselves another little little quest. Crazy Jake. Female zombies, not a problem. Any more chairs around here? Right, we'll scrap those up. Try and keep the brass intact. Uh, do we go down again? Yep. Right, it sounds like we've like we got another lumberjack outside. Don't think you can sneak up on me like that. Right, he'll be through in a minute. Let's sort out anybody else in here. Okay, we've got a few of you. I will put down Mr. T, but he's not in my hot bar. One thing, um, Darkness Falls again. Sorry, you keep referring back to it. It's got um, ten slots down the bottom rather than seven. So, and its um, backpack, this, is ridiculous. 60 something slots 67 slots or something some silly number some crazy number like that Ooh, oh oh look at this and we'll read that right let's go and sort out that um noisy ass lumberjack You made it through, yeah. What, what are you... What are you doing? You crazy fool. Oh. Stamina back. Aim. Fire. Oi. Leave me alone. Right, so we're about to go into the final part of this POI. Is there a zombie in here? No. Rain alcohol. Do not need you. I do not want the grain alcohol. What have we got in here? Right, now I am going to swap this around for Mr. T again. Going into the final room, because it can get a little bit, a little bit crazy. Now, see the yellow dot? So it shows that it's above us. They are up there, which is the, um, means they are going to fall down. Right. And 
and here we go, there's our first ferals. Oh, will you die? Get him, Mr. T. Oh my god, both of them are still up. Well, that was a little bit of a cluster. I was kind of expecting it, but not at the same time. Kind of knew it was going to happen, but didn't prepare anything for it. Right. Uh, return to Trader. Beautiful. Not before we get our loot. Going to be scrapping that. But I want to put another point into minus 69er. And see if we can one-shot these crates. Now, I did forget for the first crate. There we go. We can now one-hit these crates. Uh, didn't really make much of a difference. Might be able to put them onto some of my armor. We'll check in a second. One-shot. Okay, we're going to be scrapping that. Let's have a quick look at the armor. Um, mod slots. Mod slots. Modify. Okay, we'll put you on there. And this one's locked. We've got many lockpicks left. I lost count of how many lockpicks that was. Have we got any left? Seven lockpicks left. Okay. Lucky goggles on. Well. Okay. Scrap, scrap. Definitely take those. Scrap. Scrap. Um, 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 um what do we not need here? That's not worth anything, and we don't actually need it. I want the shot shotgun choke. I'm going to take those fittings with me, because we might need them at some point, and we'll scrap the can. Right, let's go and fill the bike up. So, guys, I didn't actually realise the big church. We've just done one over here. I think it was this business strip here we just did. We actually, our big church, which I believe we got from Trader Gen, was actually right next door to us. So, let's go and get some books, because we know there's some good books in here. So, this is uh, clear again, so we're going to have to go all the way through it. Now, I've learned from many mistakes... That does fall out. So. That's got rid of you. Now, we do know there's now ferals. We learned that the hard way a minute ago. So. You're not going to allow me onto there, are you? Don't be silly. Ooh, down in one. I wasn't, I wasn't expecting that at all. Right, there's another one down there. Another two down there. Okay, you're not running. So that's it now. We're just going to be assuming that every zombie is going to start running at us. Those crazy red eyes. Oof. Sorry, big mama. Right. Bookcases. What have we got here then? Pistol Pete, craft, hollow point, nine mil. Okay. Don't mind if I do. One percent damage until you miss 
Right, here we go. Sometimes in close quarters, you just got to spray and pray. Well, that's, that's my middle name. Fully automatic mode does 1% damage per hit until you miss. Okay. Well, it ain't going to take me long to miss, even in close quarters. We all know that. What have we got here, then? You can craft a drum magazine mods. Oh, my days. Which now means that Mr. T is going to be able to hold a lot of ammo. So we're going to be crafting up one of those as soon as possible. Here we go. He does sell for a lot. We've got a lot of money. We don't have the inventory room. We're just going to take it. Read it for the XP. It's only 50 experience. But it's better than nothing. Right. We've done all the books. Those degrade. We already know it. Right, what have we got here then? Do 10% more damage against bears. Well, seems we've been meeting some of those recently. Uh, it'd be worth having. When sneaking, you always land silently unless you are taking damage and jump height is not reduced. So there we go. So we can be a little bit more sneaky sneaky now. And I believe that's everything. Oh no. Bit of paper. Yep, we did that one first. Right, let's come. Let's come on down. Into the crypt. Now, I did there apparently there is a book. If you break these up, you have a chance of getting like rare diamonds or something. Now Spiders. Up you come, boys. I haven't got Mr. T on me again. Come on, I can see there's three or four of you down there. Get on, Mr. T. Oh, when we get you a nice drum magazine, you're going to be loving life. So, yeah, apparently there is a book for that, about taking these um, apart. Hello, OP. And I don't know if I've read the book or not. I'm not even sure which book it is. So we're just going to see if it's going to give us anything anyway, apart from the wood. All wood so far. Might be under grave wasteland treasures, maybe. Ah. Oh. Let's just have a quick look. Um... There's Wasteland Treasures. Here we go. Harvest coffins for bones, jewellery and precious gems. So, right, we don't need to keep breaking those up. It is a book. And it's a book that we don't have. But just something to take note. If you've read that book, it'd be worth taking them apart. Because I've seen a few people recently get some um, diamonds, stuff from them. So, well worth doing. Right, we do not need those two. And we do not need mouldy bread. And we're going to eat you. One other thing about Darkness Falls is you can get food poisoning from the cans, like the olden days of Seven Days to Die. So that takes a little bit of getting used to. So I've been used to this way for a little while now. Ooh. Oh, no messing about. Oh, hello. Took 
your head clean off your shoulders. A bit lackluster in those last few coffins. Right, here we go. Look at this. I love my baseball bat. Ooh, a bit of gunpowder. Oh, we'll keep that just for the second. Ooh. Getting the army involved now, are you? You're gonna need more than your army to stop the Kraken coming through. I am hearing a bit of commotion going on. We do need to kill everybody, so... Anybody else around here? No? Oh, we've got... So we've got some below us, some above us. Oh, right. Did you burp at me? some manners when you made it up here once go on jump right now it's above us don't fall we well, can fall now Oh my god, can you see that above me? Right, get you right in the junk. Now what the hell has just happened down there? Now can you all make it to me somehow? Look at that list of zombies. Right, which... How are you going to get up here? Right, you... The only one without legs has managed to make it up. Beryl. Brian. Come on. Gonna just stay here for a minute. All right, let's get you reloaded, Mr. T. As per normal, didn't wait long enough. You're not even part of this quest. Go away. Nobody likes you. Oh my dear lord. That was that lumberjack. I'm gonna take my hit take my bat. Smack you right across the face. There you go. Right. Whew. Starting to get tough really quickly, right. Now we've got the yellows up above us. So let's go and see this final loot and see what we're in for here. I can remember how to get up there. I remember. This place always confuses me. So let's just take the direct route.
Ooh, batter up. Probably not going to need that, but we'll read it anyway. Batter up. All the best players in the corner of the city, as I mentioned, you craft, you can craft baseball bats. Well, I'm pretty sure I could anyway, but maybe I couldn't. Well, ideal. We definitely know we can now. Um, we need to get up there, people. Um, how do I do that? And that's how. Oh, the barbed wire. Right, now there will be some flapping turkeys out here. Right. Now I've got you in my sights. There we go, return to trader. Not before I get my loot, though. Mm -hmm. Don't look down. I'll take my bolt back, thank you very much. And I'll take that one back. Thank you. Oh yes, I remember. Let's not be silly. And let's go. Here we go, weapons bag. Okay, more stuff we can just sell to the trader. Definitely have to go make it to some form of trader today. A bit more sham, medical. Splint. Ooh, hobo stew. No, meat stew. Jam sandwiches. Hammer. Okay. Right. Right. Out of lot picks. 10,000 hit points. Are you serious? Beauty. Um, oh, where's. Ugh. Oh. Well, wasn't anything too amazing now, was it? Right. Let's go to one of the traders. So here we go. At the trader. Quite a distance away, but I wanted hey, to get Jack one that we had actually that done. That this was for the business up. trip, I believe. But I bet you right, so we got our XP and spell. our dukes just for the killing a few of the soldiers. And yeah, here we go. So, oh, lovely. Pump action shotgun. Definitely. Definitely. We got um, a load of XP and over 2,000 dukes as well. I deal now what have you got here so we've got some threes some fours push and clear 822 level three Being what's that going to be what is important is if you have the boss to to zombies problem. pyramid 01 okay well we'll, we'll, we'll leave that on there for the I second i don't know if that is one that we have done before right we need to do some selling we, what do we need to sell? The old money. There we go. Some gold here. Sell you. We did have some silver. Yep, there we go. Sell you. Right. Steel spear parts. I have no interest in the spear. Machete. I do have an interest in that. Baseball bat parts. I definitely have an interest in them. So there we go. 20,746 dukes. And they restock tomorrow, so we'll have a quick look, see if he's got anything we want before tomorrow. Not 
Ranger's Guide to Archery. Crafting flaming arrows and crossbow bolts. They they don't do anything for me. Magnum Enforcer. Uh, I'm not going to be shooting with one. The only one I want is the one with the... They use the trader for compound bow. At a point, did he have a crossbow? I didn't look. No. Right. All right, now that we're done doing business, get out of my store. I will. With pleasure. Right, so that's it for today, folks. Two really good raids. Two really, really good raids. I'm just going to head back to the base now. We're going to do a bit more building on that overnight. And that will be that. So, as always, big thumbs up on the video if you've enjoyed it. Um, make sure you join us on Discord for all the latest updates and everything that's going on with 7 Days to Die on there. And any comments down below. And we'll catch you guys in the next episode. Take it easy. Thank <laughs> you.